So in today's lesson, we want to discuss reference angles. So a reference angle will be the angle that the terminal side makes with the x-axis. So this is given that the angle that we draw initially is in the standard position. Example one. So we are asked to find the reference angle for 120 degrees. So now we draw. So we see that 120 degrees is not up to 180 degrees. So definitely this is 0 degrees, this is 90 degrees, okay? Normally when we are drawing angle, we start from the positive x-axis position and we go counterclockwise. So if I go counterclockwise, 120 degrees might be something like this. So to find the reference angle for this 120 degrees, that means I want to find the angle that's the terminal side, that is the side where the drawing end mixed with the x axis. So we want to find this particular angle theta. So theta is going to be 180 minus 120. So in this case, theta is going to be 60 degrees. So the reference angle will be 60 degrees. So for example 2, we want to find the reference angle for 225 degrees. So just like we did in the first one, we need to first draw the uh, the angle. So for 225, definitely we went over the 180 and we went over it a little bit. So just like this. So now to find the reference angle, we need to find uh, the angle that this terminal side makes with the x-axis. So we want to find this uh, angle theta. So in this case, our angle theta is going to be 225 minus 180 degrees because we know that this line is definitely 180 degrees, but our angle, which is this 225, went above 180. So in this case, it's going to be the reference angle will be 45 degrees. Okay. So for example, 3, I'm going to find the, so we also find the reference angle of 375 degrees, okay? It's better that you visualize it to draw. So we know that when we are drawing the angle that is negative, we have to start from the positive x-axis, okay, and then go clockwise, okay? So again, well, we know that this 375 is more than 360, so definitely we are going to make a complete revolution first. So that's 360, then we will go above 360 a little bit. Okay, so that's 375 degrees. Uh, so the reference angle for this angle will now be this angle. So the reference is going to be this angle theta that it makes above that 360. So so to be able to find the reference angle theta, we just say, so this is going to be 375 minus 360, okay? So and that is going to give us 15 degrees. So for example, four, let's find the reference angle of negative 47 degrees. So again, for negative 47 degrees, so we are starting on the positive x and we are going uh, clockwise direction for the negative. Okay, so that's our negative 47 degrees. To find the reference angle, again, this is the x-axis. That angle theta would just be 47 degrees. So that's our reference angle. Thank you so much. Please remember to subscribe.